It's story time, children. Hey guys, how y'all doing out there? It's time for another tutorial from Pinnacle Studio Pro. Today, I'm gonna break down storyboarding in Pinnacle Studio 17. Let's get into it. Storyboards are used to construct a visual representation of how your story will play out in your video or film. It's basically pictures of shots that make up the scenes of your project. The shots are placed in order on the storyboard to tell the story of your film. Pinnacle Studio 17 Ultimate offers two layouts for viewing or editing your videos. It has a timeline view, which most editors are familiar with, and the storyboard view. To access the storyboard view, click on the Navigator Storyboard button and select Storyboard. You activate each track separately by clicking the Set Storyboard Track button under the lock. Once that's done, the storyboard for that track will be shown above the timeline track. The storyboard view breaks down the entire project by taking cuts in the video and using them as shots to create a storyboard. The first frame of each video clip or cut is the shot for the storyboard. A slim blue line underneath the shot shows exactly where the clip is located in the timeline below. You can place clips in the order you like by dragging and dropping them into the storyboard to see how the project will come together. If you don't like where a shot is, you can easily move a clip or shot to another position by selecting a clip with the left mouse button click, holding the mouse button down and dragging it where it fits better or keeps the story fluid. The beauty of this dual view is that you still have the ability to edit in the timeline while viewing the storyboard. You can still split, trim, add effects, create your own transitions and make other edits to your clips. If you're used to just seeing the timeline track, once you're done creating your storyboard, you can switch back to the timeline view by clicking the Navigate the Storyboard button and selecting Navigator. To remove the Navigator view from above the timeline, simply click the orange Navigator icon. Storyboarding can be a useful tool to save you time during the editing process. The storyboard view is best used when planning your video. When you begin the editing process, use the storyboard view to get a broad perspective on how everything will play out in your video. It can save you a lot of time by making it easier to spot edits or shots that don't flow well from scene to scene. Well, my Pinnacle peeps, there it is. Using the storyboard view in Pinnacle Studio 17 Ultimate. So if you want to see more of your boy, Pinnacle Studio Pro, make sure you hit me up on YouTube, hit me up on Facebook, hit me up on Twitter, hit me up on Google+, hit me up all over the world, baby. Thanks for watching. We'll see you again soon. Thank <laughs> you.